Tasha, please describe your dish. What I've done here is a creamy avocado bisque with butter poached lobster and a spicy mango salsa. Good texture. Maybe a touch more lemon would be nice just to kind of cleanse the palate a little bit. Out of 10, how would you mark that? I would say a solid eight. A solid eight, great start. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Brian, please describe the dish. I did a grilled peach burrata salad, extra virgin olive oil, salt and pepper, mint lavender. It's delicious. I think a, a seven just lacks a little creativity. OK, fine. I'm one point away, more dishes to come. Please welcome two star Michelin chef, Josiah Citron, ladies and gentlemen. All right, good to see you. Absolute pleasure. Good to How are you? Are you well? Excellent. In the battle of the hot appetizers. Latasha, please describe your dish. Chef Citron will be sampling Latasha's mushroom risotto with five minute egg. Oh, there you go. Nice. Beautiful. Wow. Look at that. Baby. Really good flavor. I would like to see a little more creamy, but mm -hmm. I didn't give it a Thank you very much. And Brian's Cajun seared prawns. Beautifully cooked. Nice balance of sweet, acidity. I would give it a nine. Wow. Thank you. With the score now tied, judging the fish entrees is two Michelin star oh, chef, Matthew Kirkley from L2O. Hi, how are you? Up first, Latasha's pan seared Chilean sea bass with bacon braised chard. Fish is beautiful, but a lot of bacon flavor there, and it's a little salty because of that. It's a seven. A seven. Got it. Wow. Followed by Brian's pan seared halibut with edamame succotash. I think the succotash is beautiful. Love the corn in there. To me, you could be pushing the salt a little bit harder on that, mm. but I think it's creative. I mean, I think that's an eight. Thank you. With Bryant maintaining a very small lead, judging dish number three, the chicken entree, is two Michelin star chef Dominique Cren. Welcome back. She begins with Latasha's herb crusted chicken breast. I don't serve chicken in my restaurant, but I think I could put that there. It's kind of sexy. Come. I'm gonna give it 10. 10. After a perfect 10 for Latasha, Bryant is hoping to match that and take back the lead with his airline chicken breast with creamed collards. It's a little bit dry for me. I think you over salted and kind of killed the dish. Seven. Really? What world are we living in? Judging our final course, another Michelin star chef and owner of MB Post, Chef David Lefebvre. Good to see you, bud. Welcome back. There's no way I'm losing. This steak is gonna kill. Bryant, explain your dish to chef. Um, I made a chipotle coriander ribeye and a chimichurri sauce to finish it. You know, the chimichurri tastes great with the steak. Technically very sound. For me, I would give that an eight. A nice. Good job. Thank you very much. I am so close to winning this right now. I can taste it. What I've done here is a pan-seared rib cap with a little horseradish cream fresh, finished with a Cabernet sauce. You might be trying to put a little too many different flavors in the same plate. The horseradish and the red wine sauce together, you may want to just go one or the other. <laughs> um, Out of 10, what would you give it? You know, for me, Please, Lord, I need the first pick. Come on, come on, come on, come on. This is mine to win. Um, I'd have to give that a nine. A nine. Thank you.